It was our very first time in Vancouver. After exploring the city by foot for two days, it was time for a little bit more action. There are so many people. So we were on a boat. We are, I don't know where, dude. Yannick's friend is the one that's taking us everywhere. I don't give up. Mm. For lunch? Do you miss home? <laughs> <laughs> I miss eating enough because it's so expensive here. I'm not eating enough. Maso. We're gonna go on a hike. I'm a little scared, I gotta say. We're not that fit when it comes to hiking. I mean, we're trying to look cool in front of Yannick's friend. We're trying to be something we're not. <laughs> Three cameramen. Yeah. And he's supposed to be amazing, so let us know in the comments if you <laughs> like that shot. <laughs> What's this place called? Lonsdale. So, Lonsdale. Lonsdale. L -O -N. Ah, yeah. So we're here at Lonsdale Quay. <laughs> and here we have a beautiful view over the skyline of Vancouver. But sadly, there's a huge ship right in the middle. Not all. Today, we're gonna go hiking with my friend who is, who doesn't want to be here. Who is that emoji face that you can see there? <laughs> he sent me a link where it said, it's gonna be super difficult hike. Oh no. Then I was like, uh, okay, what do we need? I don't have proper shoes. I'm wearing these. I don't have proper clothes. I don't have anything. He said, it's not that difficult. Yeah, for him. For him, maybe, yeah. I haven't worked out in like two months. <laughs> Joss neither. No, Just I- Just exposing you. I already said we're trying to impress him, but we are probably gonna fail. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we're tra trying to be something we're not. <laughs> I can see it coming already. We're super angry in the middle of it. <laughs> yeah, this is the end of your friendship, guys. <laughs> oh, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, let's go. We thought it was a good idea to get some food before starting our hike. Joss is getting some strength before the hike. Yeah. With the McDonald's cheeseburger. <laughs> the only thing that was there that looked cheap. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy. It was 2.15, I think. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here we are at the bottom of Grouse Mountain and we're starting our hike. Yes. And oh. I'm already out of breath, what the hell? You! <laughs> talk about yourself. <laughs> One gave me a motivational talk <laughs> <laughs> and it was awesome and now I can do anything I want. There you go, that's the spirit. Let's go. Let's okay. go. How are you doing? Good. Yeah? I'm carrying the backpack. For the first time. The time that matters the most. Yeah, I'm sure we're gonna switch after 10 minutes. Yeah, we'll see. Joss is today with her workout clothes. She looks super fit. I am fit. Since we had no idea what we got ourselves into, we were pretty motivated. But that changed quickly. So let's have a look at our gradual decline. Switch, backpacks. Ah, not even 10 minutes. I don't care. <laughs> Great. Thank you. <laughs> ah. Oh my god. I don't like it. <laughs> it's not looking great. <laughs> but then we had a reason to celebrate. So you managed to go a quarter of the way. Is it a quarter? A yeah. quarter done! Yeah. <laughs> Our excitement instantly vanished when we read the sign that said the section we had just hiked had been the easy part. And that from here on out it would get a lot worse. It also said beyond this point downhill travel was not allowed. So, this says it's the best place to turn around. <laughs> turn! But there's no way back. Let me think about it. When Joss was done thinking about it, we kept going uphill, while our mood was going downhill. You can do this! Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Joss up. hates it. Thank you for this, Juan. <laughs> As you can see... We're halfway there! Oh! Living on Gross Mountain. <laughs> Cringe fest. Cringe fest, yeah, totally. So we're halfway done. Yes. But maybe we're not. Because somehow... This has been a lie. This whole yeah, experience has been a, a lie. lie here. Juan said it would be pretty easy. <laughs> it's not. He's not even sweating, bro. Yeah, Juan? he woke up at 6 a.m. this morning and he already went on a run. I have the heaviest backpack with 1.5 liters of water yes. and huge camera. Yeah. So... I'm probably the best one here. 
we're gonna continue going uphill. We're running. We'll up let you know how it goes, but so far it's not going great. No, no, it's good. <laughs> Stop lying to yourself. I've been waiting since forever. Sure. We're doing it, people. We're doing it together. Yes. And we can do this because the world is our oyster. And also, was du heute kannst besorgen, verschiebe nicht auf morgen. Bro, look at Juan. Yeah, a little bit faster than us. He's not even sweating. What's wrong with him? <laughs> okay, it seems like it gets easier when we're getting into it. And now we can do the rest without a problem. Hopefully. Right, Joss? Yeah, hopefully. But not as easy as Juan, bro. He's literally walking like this. <laughs> like he's just walking in the park. Yeah. What are you doing, Joss? Maso. Maso? Her legs are burning. We switched the backpack again. Joss is wearing it. And I finally can walk more easily. Oh. Babe. Last section. Easy? Yeah, look. Oh. oh gosh. My legs are oh. burning. There's so many mosquitoes. The last meters. With the end inside, we collected all our strength and kept going. There are no words to describe what we had felt for the past two hours. From motivation and excitement, to dizziness and nausea. From thinking this can't be too hard, to questioning our life choices. You can do this. Proud of us? Yeah! It didn't take us long to get over our exhaustion. I mean, just look at this fella. We used the next few hours to explore around. I'm walking in the footsteps of a bear. Uh -huh. Productions, I'd like to welcome all of you to the world famous Grouse Mountain Lumberjack Show! The Lumberjack Show was definitely our favorite. Lumberjacks, ready? One, two, go! on a cable car it's open and it's a little scary but i'm still fine right now yeah joss is doing fine uh, are you these things, no but all these <laughs> things are always freaking me out I feel like a thousand pounds lighter now. I can feel all my muscles relaxing. Nice. We made it. I survived the road. <laughs> yeah, we survived the hike and, and the, the lift. 
and the view is 100% worth it. It's beautiful, you can see entire Vancouver and Baita, Umbaita, Umbaita. Yeah, look at this view. There is UBC, the University of Vancouver. That's downtown. This is Stanley Park, that's where we walked around a couple days ago. Yeah. And all of this is... Um, Unknown territory for us. <laughs> yeah. Well, Juan said a bunch of things, but I don't remember anything. Richmond. Richmond is behind Vancouver. Whoa, don't let them see into the abyss. So, it's the next morning. How do you feel? How's your body? It's not that bad actually, but I feel dizzy. Weird. Everything's moving around me. I'm a little kaput. I don't wanna move today. <laughs> I actually feel fine. My body doesn't feel bad. I expected worse. Yeah, me too. I expect it to be super sore, but I guess I'm just trained pretty well. He hasn't trained in like two months. <laughs> yeah, I know. But then maybe in the end of the day, it wasn't such a bad idea. Uh, would you do it again? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I also don't feel as bad as I thought I would. Also, you have toothpaste here. <laughs> no, it wasn't as bad as I expected. And I'm pretty fit today, but I feel a little lazy. Yeah, That's it, was, it was enough workout yesterday. Um, Josh just told me that she had a dream. No. Don't and tell in that them dream, about my dream. She was cheating on me with. Don't say the name. <laughs> We're gonna blur the name because people know who that is. <laughs> I was cheating on Yannick in the morning. I felt so bad about myself, <laughs> and then I came clean right away. Well, you dream what you certainly want, so. Sure. Okay, so it wasn't a bad idea to go on the hike yesterday. It was a interesting experience. I would not do it again, but it was nice to do it once. Yeah, maybe I would do it again if I train more and I get better at it. And what we saw on top of the mountain was definitely worth it. Yeah, it was so amazing. We had a great time. Thank you, Juan, for <laughs> taking us there. That's the end of this video. Subscribe, because in the next episode... Tandem biking! We rented a tandem bike here in Vancouver. I've never used one. Joss has never used one. No. She doesn't really know how to ride a bike. <laughs> Did Joss fall off the bike? What? And what did this person want from us? What? Subscribe to find out.